Hello everybody, Storm here. Welcome back to Stellaris, the Stella Republic campaign. In Republic news, the Republic's team in the Grand Prix was unfortunately knocked out of competition during a qualifying heat. However, in a surprise upset, the team from Unteos, the nation of recently freed slaves from the Neb, won in the finals. The wars being fought by the Star Compact and the Sooth Empire continue to rage on. Each combatant state seems unwilling to negotiate a peace deal and are trying to force the surrender of their foes. Another war has also broken out, with the Lorongo di directors declaring war on the Kark Empire. Lorongo have stated publicly that the war is to force the end of slavery in the Kark Empire and force a regime change. The initial phases of the war have been inconclusive, and we will continue to monitor as the conflict progresses. The newly reorganized fleet has been moved to the Republic's border with the Kark, while public statements from the President indicate that this is merely a precautionary measure, others believe it is a prelude to the Republic joining the Rongo's War. And that's the news. Alright, so yep, yeah, we are moving our, or we have moved, or is our fleet mostly there now? I think our fleet is mostly there. The fleet's at the border. Oh, uh, I uh, added another mod, another Cassus Belli mod. We'll see if I want to keep it or not. That's what that's all about. I'm just not going to worry about it right now. Something for the future. Alright, so the fleets are all parked here. Um, I don't think that the fleets are anywhere near being ready for another war. The army isn't ready for another war. Um, we need to expand it. Uh, the fleet needs to be... Well, it needs to get reinforced up to the state that we currently have it at. So, I mean, most of our fleets don't have all their ships. And then we have a bunch more fleets we need to set up, so then we have to build the ships for those. Uh, the army does need to be expanded now. Actually, hold on. We probably have enough to build another outpost. And now it becomes... Kappa aliens, hostile fleets. Are these guys... Oh, crystalline entities. Okay. Uh, I was worried that they might be pirates, but no, if they're crystalline entities, I'm not worried about those. Uh, let's see. This is Ocean World. This is Oasis World. I'd like to grab those if I can. So you come down here and build a starbase outpost. Okay. So while we're working on that, I don't think we need these guys on the Kuli 3 anymore. So let's embark them. Because the unrest on that planet is largely dealt with. Let's go ahead and tell them to merge in. And let's train some more troops. That's something we haven't done in a bit. Actually, I want to use the planet that has a military academy. Let's see, let's just get these guys upgraded. Which... Arcadia. Receiving transmission. Let's see, the Republic of Castoria wants to give me a bunch of energy credits in exchange for a research agreement. We definitely agree to that. Okay, so. Armors. We can train space marines here because the military academy is here. These things are expensive. Well, we can train three space marine armies. Well, at least until the, uh... Is there a limit? 
Recruit and train three more space marines. Your empire supports a total of six space marines. Okay. Research concluded. Uh, experimental subspace navigation. URSF Tregatrius has arrived in the Soul System, and somebody died. Ephria Vasatius has died. Who was the uh, scientist aboard that ship? Uh, we need a new scientist then. <laughs> Um, let's see, expertise industry. We want someone with expertise in something we don't currently have if possible. Materials. Spark and genius research speed 10. Uh, field manipulation and particles. Your field manipulation and particles. Expertise, stagecraft, naval, background. Uh, let's see. Sapient AI assistant. Statecraft and New Worlds. Do I have anybody else who has statecraft and New Worlds? You do. And you have the custom AI assistant. And you're a psychic. So this is basically the same thing. See, maniacal research speed explorer old racer void craft anomaly research speed we don't have anybody who has um industry expertise i don't think all right let's recruit you and tell you to head to the Sirius system to assist research here. Let's make sure that all my science ships are busy doing something good. Construction project concluded. Okay, so that's as many space marines. Actually, Receiving transmission. If you only have six, then that's six. All right, what do we have? Lorongo directors want a research agreement. We'll agree to that. We have a new tradition available. Commerce. Do we want to go for encourage local economies? Which unlock edicts or just economic boom. Our energy credit output is increased by 50% while energy credit gain is positive. Let's go for that. Yes. So, yep, that'll boost our energy credit income. And we have new physics research that we need. Singularity reactors. Physics campus. Defense grid. Industrialized Batharian plant, positronic algorithms, research speed, physics research grant, energy exploitation two. Okay. How much? We need 178 naval capacity. Get us some anchorages. Naval Logistics Office. It has to have an anchorage first. Okay, well, we're working on it. You don't have any anchorages. You have one. Okay. 
Go to the Naval Logistics Office. Construction project concluded. Serious station, where are you? Yep, upgrade that station too. Oh, and I deleted the... Oh, no, I didn't. Never mind. I was going to delete. I must have forgotten to do it. Uh, delete the... Kariko's Haunt Sector. We don't need it right now. We have enough core system worlds that we can manage that ourselves directly. Construction project concluded. Let me see. What does the surface look like here? Construction project concluded. Research concluded. Get a physics lab there. Uh, let's see. Engo's vapor refining is done. New research. Interstellar logistics, naval capacity plus 30. Yes, please. It's going to take 51 months. Construction project. We are kind of way short on society research, aren't we? Is there anything that I can do to correct for that? You guys are angry about stuff. Anybody here have a lot of society research? Here's some. What can I do? Someone just died. Holoseum. Military Academy. Uh, uh, Society Lab 3. Start up on the rise. A privately owned merchant corporation on Eurysthenes has been gaining popularity among your people. The company's scientists have developed several original uses of modern computing technology that make feats that were until recently beyond the general populace's, populace's wildest dreams possible. The CEO of the company, Selixa Soter Soter Soterisis, is quickly becoming one of the richest individuals in the Stellar Republic. She has asked for a patent to this product to secure her new position. Neither the patent encourage competition. Empire Energy Credits Generated plus 5%. Disgruntled CEO Modifier for 100 on rest plus 20. Let's see. Innovative CEO Modifier for 240 months, giving the following effects. Energy Credits plus 20% for the planet. Tile Physics Output plus 10%. Modifier added for... Faction happiness plus yeah, well she'll have her patent. It's fine. An alien hive has a military station. What? Hive Asteroid Hiver Nest. Oh. Oh. Well, I don't want to compromise the border defense along the Kark, 
border. So we'll send our five light flotillas to the Bozom system to rally there. And we're going to have to deal with that. Right, one more month and we should be able to build another outpost, which we're going to grab this system here. Uh, let's see, you guys can actually come down here, build a research station. Uh, you guys build mining stations. There we go. You can go over here and build a star base. Now, did that Engos Vapor unlock anything? It doesn't appear so. I don't think I have any of it. No, I don't. There's a Steam Age Primitives in that system. That could be an interest. That could be a good source of society research. Inspiration or delusion? Ah, the legendary. This is the Car the elusive Carcosa event. Yes, following the recent passing of a respected science officer. The recovery of various notes and documents from the late scientist's lab point, paints a curious picture. It seems that in their twilight years, they developed an odd obsession. The creature they named the elusive Carcosa. It's difficult to decipher what exactly was so unique about this animal, but the late scientist seems to have regarded its acquisition as a top priority. According to the notes, the creature was last sighted on Pythrex. With the use of research vessel sensors, finding it should be trivial. There may be something to, bit to this. Situation log updated. Okay, do we have an available science ship? Uh, you should be available. Let's track that on the map. Let's have you take care of that. Mm, need skill two or better. All right, then. Do we not have a science ship in the soul system? No, it would appear not. That's alright. You can head over here and do the research projects. What do we have here? Concluded. A lot of stuff needs upgrade. So you probably just build out the economy districts. Construction project concluded. Construction project concluded. Society lab. It says there's something here that needs to be upgraded. I don't see it. That can be upgraded. 
Ah, uh, the United Republic of Naras has made peace with the Padishah Empire. It's about time. A new human empire will be created uh, as an ally and subject, as an ally or subject of the United Republic of Naras, of two occupied imperial systems. Okay. So the U human United States has been broken off the Padishah Empire. Serious. Interesting. Must have reused the name. Uh, let's see. They are independent. They are not a subject. Construction project concluded. They have entered a, migra a migration treaty. Okay, what do we get? We got uh, Corazine Refinery. Degenerate Matter Reactors. Advanced Barrier Shields. Planetary Barrier Shield Generator. Improved Assist Research. I guess we can do the Improved Assist Research, considering we are assisting research these days and actually you can probably come back here and assist research on earth so i thought i had a science ship doing that already but apparently i do not so we will correct that padishah empire will now guarantee the independence of the human united states okay construction project concluded construction project concluded Pasha Empire has entered into a defensive pact with the Kanyugu Coalition. The human United States has joined the Star Compact. I pretty much saw that coming. Non-aggression pact. The Sinidian Interplanetary Hegemony has entered into a non-aggression pact with the Nahinto Consortium. Nahinto Consortium. Decide to end their association status with the Star Compact. Apparently they do not like the human United States. Interesting. Construction project concluded. Construction project concluded. Okay. So, Remaining let's hostiles. see here. Whoa. Now... This is a hive or hive. I don't know if it's going to be such a good idea to attack this. Uh, but we'll see. Alright, unlock feature improved assist research is done. Sapient combat simulation. Sapient combat AI. I uh, don't know so much about that. Um, quantum field manipulation. Singularity reactor. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we're still training the last of the Space Marines. Construction project concluded. Let's see, it's going to take 28,000 minerals to completely reinforce the fleet as we have it set now. Those need to get upgraded. 
System survey concluded. We can upgrade that building. It seems it just takes energy to remove these top blockers. Let's go ahead and take it out. Federation election, we can trust only ourselves. Uh, why is there election for leadership? Because there should not be any elections. So apparently this doesn't work. This is supposed to be permanent. Either that or there's something I'm missing. All right, one more month and we can build another outpost station. Those guys are a little bit far behind. All right, there we are. Go ahead and build an outpost. There. And you can build mining stations. And why haven't you finished that mining station yet? The Nihinto Consortium would like to cooperate more closely with the Grand Republic. Leaving aside the question of membership, would you consider granting us association status? We definitely would. Which is these guys here, right? Yep. They are... They will not it's join a, a federation with the Castorians, so we may have to go to war with them at some point. How goes the war? Natural wormhole. What? Remian Empire? Evading hostiles. See, attacker war exhaustion is at 25%, defender war exhaustion is at 36. So the Lorongo are actually ahead of the game. Now, it's going to cost us what to open this gateway? 10,000 energy and 5,000 minerals. I don't think that's going to be something that we are going to do just yet. It is going to take us a while to build the minerals we need. To get the fleet built. Construction project concluded. We can currently afford to reinforce one ship for 2,800 minerals. Research concluded. All right, we got dreadnoughts. All right, let's see. Flak batteries, light carrier, cruiser, ship sections. So we can make our cruisers carriers? Dry dock modules. Citadel upgrades. Um, let's actually grab the armor. It's pretty cheap. Unlocks army tank divisions. Oh, okay. Yes. 
Yes, please. Tank divisions. So right now we just have light armor. We don't actually have like real tank divisions. So receiving transmission. They are proposing a migration treaty. We agree to this migration treaty. The Kark have insulted us. You will forgive me if I dim my display, human. I simply cannot stand to look at your nauseating appearance. Really. Well, you know what we're going to do? We're going to insult you back. The cruel oppression of the people living under the yoke of the Kark Empire has to end to one day. Your authoritarianism will prove your undoing. Confirm. And then we're going to declare them as a rival. There. How about that? All right, scientist or a fiche Hasselsa has leveled up. Okay, good. I'm going to need to look into this before I hit it, because if I'm going to whack a hornet's nest, I need to make sure that I will be able it. to defeat said hornet's nest. Uh, so I'm going to... I need to look into this before I send any ships after it. Okay, our science officer's notes appear to have led us on a wild Carcosa chase. There is no evidence of such a creature ever existing. Disappointing. All right, you can come back to Alva Centauri then and uh, resume your research assistance. And that's a bit of a graphical bug. I think so I think that's the planetary shield isn't not covering the planet okay or someone made a really really big mistake when they built that generator All right, so we're building construction project concluded. There. I just finished. All right, we'll work on the mining stations. That's done. You can do the mining stations there and then do the research stations. I'm trying to think, do I want to continue to absorb territory up into here and here? Or leave that for the Ostia Theocracy. Um, I say we should probably try to grab it if we can. It'll take another couple months. What is this? Mineral. So those are ancient mining drones. Starbase is two. We not, have not upgraded these to shipyards because they're primarily border defense stations. Construction project concluded. At least that's what they're going to be at some point. All right, we're up to the 6,500 minerals. What is our cap? 2,500. And how much is it going to take? 28, not 2,500, 25,000. It's going to take 28,000 to reinforce. Okay, so let's just go ahead and, and reinforce those two ships. A Ulysses class carrier concluded. is being built. Ah, we already have the 
The carrier in the home fleet. Discovery, ancient temple. Ooh. Scientist Terrasonis Thanaxise on board the science vessel Einstein has made a strange discovery on Pizil B3A. An ancient temple dedicated to an age long gone has been found on this world. Writings on the murals indicated it was a temple shared by many different alien species. The images on the walls depict the aliens as creatures with unusual powers, moving objects with their mind, wielding glowing sticks, and participating in a lot of meditating. They appear to have been of a culture that embraced diversity and desired to protect everyone. Well, that sounds familiar. So where is the Einstein? Way up there. Way up there. We've found one of the ancient temples of one of the old psionic orders. Construction ship. It would require 258.9 more influence to build an outpost there, but it may be worth doing. Hopefully we could get to it before somebody else does. All right, we're going to go ahead and end this episode with that. And uh, I'm going to see what we're going to do there. All right, so hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.